Hey guys, AJKCG here, and today we're going to test out the Canon M50, the original M50, not the new upgraded version, with my Rokinon 10 millimeter lens. I have never tried this with real estate photos. Let's uh, take some photos and see how they turn out. All right, you don't need to watch me take each individual photo. So in this one, we're going to compare the M50, which has a 1.6 crop factor to my Canon 90D which also has a 1.6 crop factor. So uh, let's start comparing them. And if you have any comments or questions, let me know. And be sure to like and subscribe if you find any of this information helpful. All right, let's get started comparing. Uh, in this shot, we uh, got the flowers there uh, in the middle of the island as a good point of reference and the window. Those are the two main things we're going to be focusing on. And uh, on the M50, at first glance, it's not too bad. Not a lot of color in the photo, but it does a decent job. If you zoom in, the flowers are a little bit blurred. Now let's compare that to the Canon 90D. A little more color, a little bit better out the window, and zooming all the way in, those flowers are still in focus. So that's a pretty big difference there. All right, let's check out the next shot. I did a straight on of the island and a little bit washed out. Uh, if you zoom into the flowers, color quite isn't there and is pretty blurry. Let's check out the 90D, a little bit more color and you zoom into the flowers, a lot more detail. Let's go back and forth. Let's go back and forth between those two. So the M50, 90D. Now remember, this is the same lens just different cameras, M50, 90D. Now let's check out the M50 in, so the master bath, this is pretty good. Again, it's passable. Let's compare it to the M90. And uh, you get more natural colors, more detail. Focus on the M50 details and the 90 details like the plant. Of course, it's gonna be blown out here. And on the M90, or blurry, it is pretty crisp and clear. So as you can see, the M50 does an okay job. I would not use it for luxury listings, but if you uh, are just starting out, just doing small apartments, condos, uh, beginner starter homes, track homes, something that uh, isn't staged, things like that, the M50 is definitely passable. Uh, you could definitely use it for multitude of things because people aren't going to be comparing those pictures and they're not going to be zooming in on things. Let me know what you thought about the comparisons, what you think about the M50, possibly using it in your work just to start out. You know, if you have stuff right now, you might be able to use what you have until you make some money to grow bigger. If you found this helpful, like, subscribe, make a comment below if you have any questions and I'll see you on the next one. Have a great day. Um, I'll put links in the below. Enjoy your video.